What's up, Erks? It's Joe here with some more Fallout Frost. Last time we found our note for sunken treasure, and today we're gonna go look for it. So, let's get a move on. Let's go ahead and make our way off the ship here. I'm not even gonna bother using the lift because we're going right into the water. And this time, it's daytime, so we might possibly be able to see the sunken treasure. I'm not trying to... Well, I'm trying to fill my water bottle there. Now, if I'm going to be able to see it, I don't know, honestly, because, I mean, when I do that little glitchy thing, it is a lot deeper than I was expecting, so there's a good chance that we won't be able to get this. I did just save, so I will try my hardest to at least get down there. If I drown, whatever, we saved, then anything, if anything, it's just like a faster way back to that freighter. It would be nice if I had Aqua Boy or a Power Armor suit. Granted, the Power Armor suit would take forever to get under. So let's just get right to where I need to go. Now, unfortunately, what really sucks about this is that the marker for this buried treasure... Oh, wait, no, it is actually on top of it. Never mind. I thought it was on the water last time. Maybe because I got here, it, it started going down. All right, we're 66... Oh, my God, it's so far down. I'm waiting for my stamina to come back here. It is so far down. All right, one, two, three. Here we go. I just want to see what it is. I don't even know what it could be. I don't even, okay, my light's on now. Okay. There's no way we're going to get this, by the way. Let's fast, 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 fast. There it is, there it is, there it is. Okay. Money. Psycho tats. Are you serious? That's it? That's it? Go up. That's all we get. Money and psycho tats. Am I even going to be able to surface in time? I'm really far under the water. Oh, yeah, here we go. Oh, I'm dying. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, we made it. <laughs> All right. So, let's head back to land. I'm not even going to bother going to the Wreck of Liberty because we are heading to my home. So, what I'm going to do... Now, I could just cross this way, or I could just, like, follow the water. I think I'm gonna cross that way, though. I think I'm gonna enter land and just cut through. It's more dangerous that way, but I think it might be faster, and faster right now is what I want. Uh, oh, wait, no, we left the pistol. Mm. The pistol is here. Alright, let's go back for that pistol, because I do want that. So we're gonna grab the pistol. It is next to that robo. No, it's in the red rocket. That's right. Uh, because I was gonna put it next to the robo, and then I remembered I changed my mind to the red rocket because that's more iconic. So it's on. It's in the red rocket, right in front of the checkout counter. We'll go grab it, and I think I can swim while carrying something. So we should still be able to cut across through the water without having to take the land route back home. I'm gonna try and avoid the Boston Airport, by the way. Rather not fight any ghouls right now. Even though we're going to Fort Independence, and that's going to be fucking full of them. But I kind of want to save my ammunition for exactly that. Ooh, money. Because, I mean, once we get there, it's going to be... Ooh, more money. A decent fight, I think. Especially consider... Well, I mean, we have laser, lots of laser ammo, and that's scoped and everything, so... We should be fine. Granted, I don't like using scope against ghouls, but with insanity, scope is the only thing that's viable at this point. Unfortunately for me. Let's go ahead and drink the other vodka I picked up. And let's get that pistol and then hopefully start heading back home. We have one whiskey left besides the vodka, so I'm hoping that lasts until I can get home. I highly doubt it. If I stop anywhere... Is that a cooler I just saw? No. If I stop anywhere, that's not going to last. Oh, fuck. That scared me. If I stop just to check something out for a few seconds, there's no way it'll last. So there's a good chance... If I don't find alcohol on the way home, I'm going to have to drop something. Which is kind of unfortunate, because I already have my hands full with the pistol here. I just want to be really careful here. I think I might want to save. Yeah, let's save. Whoa, that was a weird little spike of stutter there. Let's just go ahead and save, because I did swim all the way out to that honestly not worth it treasure. I don't want to have to do that again. And just in case the Assault Tron... Decides to give me a nice little greet. I just want to make sure we have our progress saved. I don't see it anywhere. So let's grab the pistol in here. There's mongrel dog meat, but I have tons of deer meat. That's fine. And Mr. Gutsy. I, I see the Sultron. 
Look at it. It's right there. He is. He's right past some Mr. Gutsu. He can't bats him because he's too far away. But he's over there. That's where he is. So we're just gonna jump in the water and hopefully we can carry this gun. If we can't, sorry, pistol, but I gotta leave you behind. Also, it's a little bit off center and I feel like I have a less grip on it because of that. So let's just. Eh, it's a little bit off center to the right now. Whatever. Who cares? All right. Let's see. Yep. Okay. So I can I can still paddle while carrying a gun. And checking my pit boy at the same time. Yep, that seems, uh, seems right. It seems, seems doable. I'm not gonna argue with it. I can also sprint in here, too, so we'll just go ahead and do that. And actually, I'm gonna mark the coast. I should have done that first. Let's mark right here, because that looks like the best place to land. I mean, I don't know what's there. Could be full of robots. Might be the worst place to land. But it seems okay. I don't want to accidentally, like, get my gun stuck. If, if the water, like, sticks the gun at all and I start sprinting, it will fly out of my hands and go underwater. And there's no fucking way we're getting that back then. Oh, I see survivors to my right. Two of them. Possibly two. At least one sitting. Unless that's just a skeleton. No, that's definitely a survivor. Alright, I'm gonna try and take them out once I get to land here. You know, I haven't seen hunters in a while. I guess these could be hunters. Oh, no, they're cultists? Down here? Really? Interesting. Okay, well. Mm. Mm. There we go. We're almost leveled up. Let's go and switch to the melee weapon because I saw mute crabs around here. I should really clear the area out before I start walking with that. In fact, okay, so I'm leaving the pistol next to the little piece of wood over here. I want to clear this area out of cultists. Just in case they try to throw things at me. Because that would be less than ideal. Oh, shit. Yeah, I did panic a little bit there and used one more bullet than I needed to. Mainly because of that. They have throwables. They always have throwables. <laughs> oh, my God. I wanted that dirty bomb. Fuck that. I don't want it anymore. You can keep it, buddy. That's not the wood it was on. Oh, God. Get it, get it, get it. Get it. Go, 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 go. Please don't catch up to me. Please don't catch up to me. Please don't catch up to me. Okay, I think we're... I think we're good. Oh, shit, ghouls. Oh, shit, a tank. Cool. Oh, shit, he sees me. That's a festering, too. Fuck! I want him to, like, fall over real quick. Or, like, do an attack on me and trip over himself, you know, so I can get him without him getting me. Come on, buddy! You son of a bitch! You know what? Fuck it. Give me the shotgun. That increased recoil, though. Uh, let's go ahead and take that whiskey, which I already took. I thought I didn't. Do I have any other alcohol? Could have sworn I still had that whiskey, but I don't. Shit. That's not good. I'm gonna have to drop some of this deer meat then. Actually, I'd rather drop cow meat. Even though ribeye is really good, I'm actually gonna eat the other ribeye. The deer meat's just way better because of what it can do. Yeah, like hitting this thing, like. Maybe I'm, I'm kind of... Oh, shit. Okay, it's hit me anyway, so I'm going to just go for it. Yeah. I am kind of glad that I didn't leave the pistol behind now. Because, fuck, this gun's bad with the insanity problems. Holy shit. Uh, I'm going to go with the strong back perk, even though I want to go more towards Party Boy. It's because in two levels... Actually, no. 20... Because I need 30 for this plenty. Plus 20, so... Strong back, over encumbered run. I, that might work, though. The good, though, I think. So I'm gonna you do that real quick. And that was a festering, so he did do some damage to me. I don't like that there's glowing over here. It could be just fungus. Really should grab it, though. Really? There he is. Oh, <sighs> fuck me, dude. Oh, I forgot. If you click R, you chuck things. I'm so glad I didn't do that in the water. So glad. Right, let's set the gun down here and try and check the area real quick. Yeah, 
cultists all over the place. Looks like a whole cultist camp here. Okay. Well. Could just avoid it. But yeah, we don't have to kill everything we see. Let's avoid the combat. This is safer. I don't have much carry space anyway, so it's not too beneficial to me. I won't discover the area, just so if we ever come back around this way, I'll see that it's not discovered. And even if I don't remember that I was here, although I'm pretty good at remembering if I've been somewhere in, the, in, in a playthrough. Just not if I've been somewhere in a previous playthrough. Um, I should recognize the area, but either way, as long as it's not discovered, I will be like, Oh, that needs to be looted, and we'll loot it. Or I can just take the highway home. Is that the bridge? Let me see. Yeah, let's take this this highway here. This bridge, whatever it is. No, it's actually the highway, yeah. This is the uh, the little the overpass. Again, I don't want to discover this location. I might accidentally do it. If I do, then whatever. Then I know where it is for future. But, um... Oh, there it goes. Easy City Downs. Huh. Easy City Downs. I guess I'll put this here real quick and check this out. Wow, this is a pretty big camp you got here. Whoa! Oh, that wasn't at me. They have a pretty big camp here. It's like a whole little, this is like one of their, their main areas, and... Okay. Oh! oh. <sighs> wow, I'm so glad that didn't kill me. I was so ready to get really salty. I was like, like, the the tensing of all my body parts happened there, and I was just like, you son of a fucking bitch, and I survived. Not even a little bit of damage. I am so, so happy that did not do anything. Holy shit. What's this? Might be something here. A little camp looking thing? You know, if I do clear the area, I might find some alcohol, which I'll be able to drink and then, you know, walk or carry a little bit more with, but, uh, eh. I, we're already so close to being way over encumbered, I think it's fine. Let's just keep moving. Once we get past the airport, we should be able to just start sprinting to home, because it's not that far away. And frankly, most of that area is cl Well, no, it's not, actually. I haven't cleared out a lot of the stuff between the airport and my house because I went the underground path, but I think we should be fine. Let's just go ahead and drop this in vats a little bit. Okay, we're good. Let me see, I need to cut through to there. Hopefully there's no resistance on the beach, but if there is, well, we'll deal with it when we get there. I'm not seeing anything that's trying to kill me here. This is going to be the day of... Oh, so the water doesn't even get stuck. Good to know. This is going to be the day of combat avoidance. Also, I'm not even going to where I marked. Whatever, I don't care. The farther south I am, the closer I can get to... Actually, no, wait. This is the southern... This is the southern part of the river. So, no, the farther north I am, the better I am. There's something here. I can't vats right now, but I hear something trying to get me. Like, walking. Oh, God, the FPS is shitting itself right now because the city's loading in. And that... That does not bode well. That... Well, there's a big ship, first thing. But second thing... That looks like a little bit of a military barge. Which tends to have people... There are two ships! What the fuck? What just happened to that ship? Why did it just teleport like that? What is this? What? What? Wait, what? Wait, what? Why is this... What? Why is this out here? I'm thoroughly confused. I don't think I can go on this, can I? It's solid. Did I just drop my gun? Okay, no, I didn't. What? Why is this here? I am thoroughly confused right now. I think... I'm just going to go home, because I cannot investigate at the moment, not with this gun in my hand. I am thoroughly confused, though, why that ship is there, 
and not currently on a building. Hmm. That must be a frost thing that they moved it off the building. Oh, no, I was about to say because that maybe I think because that ship uh, gets crashes into that building not right as the nuclear or not right as the bombs fell, but like after. So maybe that technically didn't happen yet, and that's why it's still in the water. Like it tries to leave and you know, or this could be more likely the frost dev has not done anything with that okay we're fighting it has not done anything with the quest involving that ship yet and because of that we just moved it so no one can get on to it what the fuck that wasn't cool i'd be really careful these guys do quite a bit of damage See, I can't kill those ghouls. And they give constant radiation, too. There we go. Oh, it's not dead. Bitch. Huh. But yeah, uh, what I'm thinking is the Frostev just hasn't done anything with that quest yet. And uh, he just moved it so none of the players can get in it. Because it's easier to do that. Which, you know... That's fine. Whatever. It's kind of cool just to see it in the water, honestly. Just kind of caught me off guard. I wasn't expecting that. I don't know. Maybe there is something there that is specifically frost related. Like, not just like a placeholder. Maybe there actually is a quest. Bryant Hill's journal? Wait, what? Hold on. We got some stuff here. First is Bryant Hill's journal. Damn muties, I walk around out here, here, shambling around. Disgusting, I swear I'll kill every last one I see. Abominations. And then you turned into one. Rip. Hadrian's invitation. Hadrian. Hadrian. Oh, it's a voice thing. Oh, they're saying about Jamaica Plain where they hit all the treasure before the war. Now I can go find the treasure of Jamaica Plain. Yeah, yeah. I'm not really interested. What? Oh, what? That's cool. So, okay. So you know how you, when you're over encumbered, you, um, you can't really move normally? For some reason, I thought, you know, the perk, I, I thought it was like, you you can move with your action points. You just can't move normally with your action points. But no, you can move normally with your action. Like like it's it's normal movement. I thought it was gonna be less than that for some reason. I don't know. I don't know why I thought that. I, I had no reason to. But for some reason, that's what I thought. I take a few bandages or one just to get that out of my inventory. But yeah, that's cool that you can move around at full speed as long as you use your action points. Granted, in Frost, your action points go down so fucking fast that it's kind of. You know, not that great. It's a little burst of, uh, of, I guess, movement to get into cover if you need it. Which, you know, that's still worth it. But really, I've just taken that perk so I can get to the next level. The fourth level. Plus 20, I think it was? Or plus 30 carry weight? I think it was plus 20. There's something here. Dogs. Two of them. Okay. We good? The FPS is shitting its pants right now just because of all the shadows and all the buildings. There's a glowing one out there who looks pretty fucked up. I'm not going to go near him. Also, it looks like there could be a survivor camp right here. Got to be a little bit careful as I just walk right through it. I think I cleared this one out, but I don't remember. I don't actually, you know what? I don't think I have. I have not. FPS just dropped the shit. Let's see if I can't kill someone without them waking up. Oh, never mind. You're already getting up. <laughs> Wow, I still got a sneak attack off of the melee gun. That is interesting. I never did that before. And I killed some before they retaliated. Hell yeah. Give me that ammo. Another person right there. All sorts of Mr. What the fuck? Apparently there's a Mr. Handy right here. Um, hi, Mr. Handy. <laughs> it's not the first time I've seen that. I don't know why it does that sometimes. It's weird. I could have sworn I've been here before, but maybe not. Really? Hold on, let me TCL. 
Really? Okay, there we go. I was about to say, you can't not give me that body. I just killed him with an awesome sneak attack, and you're gonna not give it to me? You know what? I'm just gonna chuck a grenade, because that put us overweight. Maybe that'll get him coming over here towards me. I've got one bullet left, so I better make it count. I just saw a shadow pass. He might come through here. Oh, it's a girl. There we go. Out of ammo with that. Let's switch to this. Reload it. In fact, let's just use the 50. My pistol has been left on the east side of the camp. Okay, you're the one with the gun. Three away rounds! Ash! I'm totally switching this back over once I get home. Okay, there are a lot of people here. Oh, well, they're all up there, that's why. Another one bites the dust, and unfortunately he didn't- Well, I think some of his body parts might have fallen down so I could loot that. I'm over encumbered again. Let's drop some of these frag mines. Drop three of them. For turrets. Nothing. Don't want to loot this place, by the way. We're just going to leave. Oh, his body did fall. Nice. Where is he? Is I think he's right above me. Nuka grenade? Wait, I thought dirty bombs were nuka grenades. I didn't know nuka grenades were actually still in it. Awesome. I don't know. Maybe that's a bug or something? I don't know. Who cares? Let's just go ahead and, uh... Really? There we go. Grab the pistol and let's get out of here. Let's just go home. Because I am way too over encumbered to actually pick anything else up that actually matters. I mean, I just picked up 308 rounds and that put me over the edge. Hey, there's the Alliance outpost that we saw before. Hopefully it's not repopulated with Alliance people. It shouldn't be. We did kill them all, but I, I suppose it's possible. Yeah, I have been here before, because I remember fighting them when I went to the Alliance outpost. Ah, uh, maybe not, maybe not. I don't know, I don't care. It's irrelevant right now. Let's see if I can't save real quick. Oh, can't save there. That's okay. Don't really want to get the sleeping bag out right. Ah, you know what? You know what? If I don't save right now and I end up dying on the way to my house, I'm seriously going to be so pissed off at myself. Because there have been times where I thought, maybe I should save. And then I thought, no, it's fine. We don't really need to. Also, I'm mildly dehydrated. It's fine. We don't need to. Then I died, and holy shit, was I pissed at myself. Because I could have saved. I don't know why I didn't. But then I died. Holy fuck, it's actually populated. That was on not... Okay. Interesting. No, I missed! Flamer, flamer, flamer! Automatic gun! Okay. Well, good thing I saved, just in case. Shotgun. Another gun? I want to kill before I even retaliated. Chuck grenade over there onto the stage. Huh. You know, I wasn't expecting this place to be repopulated. Holy fuck, was I wrong. Whoa! FPS just dropped massively. Let's get up here. Whew. Okay, let's take a surgical kit, because I don't think that actually drains any uh, thirst or anything. Surgical kit doesn't heal you, it just fixes a... Broken limb, fucking hell. I think he might be coming up here. Is he? No, yeah, he is actually. He went back down. Shit. Okay, we got him. <sighs> I was not expecting what I found. I'm not really upset with it, though, because there's going to be a ton of fucking ammo from this, but fucking hell. That kind of threw me. He's using a shotgun. 
45 rounds. Shit. Oh, he had a pipe bomb pistol. Good. Oh, we had that. Good. Because that should double both the ammo types if it works properly. I don't know. It seems like it might have. No, it didn't double the 45. So I'm guessing because he was using the shotgun, that's why I doubled that and didn't double the 45. Okay. That's, that makes sense. Hopefully this guy was using the rifle. I think he was, but uh, they only gave us two more rounds. Gave our fuel. Hey, there's my gun. Shotgun shells. Ooh, that's 30 bullets if it doubled. Uh, didn't, it, it didn't double, but it gave me more ammo. Um, yeah, there's no way, because I had 9 bullets and I just picked up 15, so it gave me a little bit more. Not much. It gave me, like, what, 6 more bullets? God, there's so much ammo here. Holy shit. Ooh, that might have just given me a lot more, too. Do I have 52 now? 47. Okay, so I was wrong. Wow. Man, it was doubling every single... Whoa, my FPS. It was doubling, like, every single time before. Like, it was exactly doubling every single fucking time before. And now it never doubles. It just gives me a different number. So, man, was I proven wrong fast. That actually surprises me. Alright, let's get out of here. There's a lot of bottles here, but we'll come back for them if we need to. I am going to save, though. <sighs> okay. So... I didn't expect there to be more enemies here, but I'm not gonna lie, I'm really happy there were. And the reason for this is because I thought the frost respawn timer was, and it didn't respawn loot from, oh wait, no, this is locked now though. Hmm, maybe it did. Uh, the frost, I'm gonna say that just, we'll just use the frost respawn timer in general then. The frost respawn timer, I was assuming was gonna be very long. Got it. Because it's a hardcore mod, you know? And, uh, well, I, I don't know, I, I don't know. A lot of times, more hardcore mods, they like to, Make it so that you don't, or that it doesn't respond very fast. Respond, respond very fast. I guess are more realistic mods, maybe. Yeah, maybe not hardcore mods. Maybe just realistic mods. I guess so you can't grind areas, and so it's not like, you know, you can just keep going back and leveling up over and over. But like, this makes the world feel more alive. Like this, I prefer it this way, where there's still. I don't know what the uh, the numbers are for a respawn. I thought it was like a week in-game time for a respawn, and I, there's no way we've been gone here for a week. Maybe, maybe we have, or maybe two weeks, I thought. But, um, yeah, I don't know. I, I'm glad that things are respawning faster than I anticipated, because that makes the game way fucking more fun. Also makes it harder, because there are a ton more things that can kill me, but that engagement right there, completely unexpected, I loved it. That was awesome. That's why I play Frost, because the, the engagements are the best part. Like, walking around like this is also pretty fun, though, because you never know when you're going to get shot at. But once you're actually in combat, and you're fighting for your life, and surgical kitten and stuff, and people are jumping out, and you almost die in, like, a few bullets, and you have to quick run to cover, I really like it. The engaged and frosts are probably the best, the, the imbest, yes, the best engagements I've experienced in Fallout 4. No, they're definitely the best engagements I've experienced in Fallout 4, because I don't really like Fallout 4 vanilla engagements anyway. They're too easy. Ooh. All right, we're coming to the back street of peril. So these guys might be out here. I know their turrets are still alive because I didn't kill them last time. Their turrets are there, and I think I see a person. Yep. Okay. So they're out there. I'm not gonna bother. We're gonna go the back way. I don't want to fight the. Just chuck my fucking gun down the stairs. I don't want to fight the turrets right now because I don't want to waste ammo on them. And I mean, I don't have to fight them. I've killed them before without fighting the turrets, but I'd rather just get home. And store all my shit. I don't know if I can vats so I'm holding something, so I'm... I am spamming vats, because if it does work, I want to see any frag mines in front of me, because I know this place was mined previously, or at least around here. But I'm just keeping my eyes peeled in case vats does not work when I'm holding a gun. Or holding something in general. Like, I hear the, I hear the sound that you're not finding anything, but it could... Maybe it's, it's possible it's just not doing anything. I think, is this the way I can go to get to my base really easy? I can't remember if this is the back way in. I think this is. This is where the power armor dude died, like down here. I thought this is where the... That scared me, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just chucked the gun. <laughs> that fucking explosion scared me. There's a fight going on. 
Chris Warren, this is where I saw frag blinds before. They do not. What is going on over there? I'll have to check it out soon. I have to be careful. What if their people respond in my home? I don't know how the respawn mechanics work in a settlement once you've uh, claimed it for yourself. What the fuck is that? Is that a. That's a Gauss rifle, isn't it? That's a fucking Gauss rifle, I think. I can't tell. I think that's a Gauss rifle. Because that can't be an expl- like... It's not a missile launcher. Whatever is it? Is that a missile launcher? It sounds like it's over from Backstreet Apparel. I'll have to check it out. Alright, let's get our guns ready in case there's someone living in our house. One, two, three. Front door's clear, let's get in there. Wow, that was a good throw, you idiot. I'm gonna chuck it over the wall, not into it. Alright, we're good. Oh, we're home. Alright. Good, good. Let's just go ahead and throw this here. And uh, what I can do real quick is store all this shit, take that out. And let me go ahead, and the first thing I'm going to do is my Reba. I'm going to change it to the Calibrated Receiver. And I could, I, I'm going to do some gun modding, which I think I will do. But the first thing I'm going to do is store all my shit. I'm going to do it this time, not next time, because I'm doing it either way. Oh, first, well, no, let's do this first, because I don't want to save with this shit not stored. First thing first, let's cook. Okay. Bear ribs, that gives plus 15 damage distance for one hour. Nice. Go ahead and cook all this venison. Is everything there? Okay. Good, good, good. Let's actually drink that purified water since we are dehydrated. Just drink it all there. And let's start storing everything. Actually, let's store the guns first. I don't want this. I do want everything else, I think. Yeah. Well, I, I don't want the pistol. I'm going to store that too. So pistol, and then, ammo-wise, we don't need, 38 rounds we need, 44, we don't need, 45, I think that's 45 out 70, we don't need, 10 millimeter, we don't need, 5.56, we don't need, 5 millimeter, we don't need, fusion cells, we actually do need, plasma, no, shotgun, no, um, and yeah, I know there's 5.56 lying back at, uh, the compound, but, you know, whatever, we'll get that eventually, alright, good, that's all stored, let's go into here, and let's store some of our Actually, I'm going to keep all the bandages, because I still think those are useful. Simpax, on the other hand, not as much, because bandages are just way better. In fact, I'm going to store until I only have 10. Surgical kits are even better, though, because I use a Stimpak to heal a broken limb, but with a surgical kit, I don't need to. Radex. No, 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 no. Almost fucked that one up. Let's store 15 Radex. Psychojet, let's store four of that. Medex. Four, jet fuel, all. Irradiated blood, all. Uh, I didn't mean to store the jet. Aid, 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 okay. Um, blood pack, all. Day tripper, daddy -o. Fury, I'll store one of those. Glowing blood pack, we'll store six of those. Glowing fungus, no. Grid venison, I'm gonna keep on me, even though we don't store it in here anyway, so. Whatever. Um, that's good. I'm gonna keep the XL on me. And I don't think there's anything else I really want to store. I think that's it. I think we're good. We're done. Shit, yeah. Now, mod-wise, I think I might want to wait till next time to do some modding here. Just because I don't know... Like, I don't want to... I don't know off the top of my head what I want to put on guns. I guess... I guess I just want to make it... Any gun I have stronger. Now, the Reba already has those powerful things you can put on it. Also has the long light barrel. I don't have any screws though, so there's a good chance I won't be able to do anything like that. Uh, I can put a muzzle brake. Inferior range, recoil control is better. Reduce range, improve recoil control. No, I don't want to put either of those on them. I need range with that, especially more than anything else. Yeah, so unfortunately, we're going to need more screws. Which, again, I kind of knew. We knew this before. I just didn't pick them up because that was not the important thing. Is there anything else that I need stored? Oh, purified water, yes. Is there anything else I need stored? Beer bottles, yes. Uh, 
Uh, or anything else I need to take, rather. Okay, no bottles. We're good. The mods... I guess you don't need the medium night vision scope, but the 50 cut receiver I like to keep on me, just in case I pick any 50 up. In fact, I'll take our 50, because that's nice. And I think we're good to go, then. Is there any rifle in the game that uses 44? I can't remember off the top of my head. I don't think there is. It would be really nice to get a rifle that uses 44, though, because 44 is really fucking good. Also, combat sniper rifle 66 damage. This is 82 because it's hardened. Okay, just making sure I have the best of best in here. Alright, I think we are done then, so let's fill- Oh, no, 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 don't fill it there, because I'll take forever. Let's go ahead and save, and with that, I think I'm going to end today's survival here. So I hope you all enjoyed it, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.